All right, so just finished at the National Palace Museum. It was really interesting. There was a lot and I got really hungry, so I am gonna go now, but I'm really glad that I came. All right, so here's the deal about an international pandemic. Uh, there's no one. So got to see the palace pretty much alone. no one on the grounds. I've seen like a couple people. There are some people here, but just like inside, really nobody. Um, everybody's being very cautious. They have you put hand sanitizer on before you even enter the building. Everyone is wearing their masks, like the three people that are in there. Everyone's wearing their masks, um, but it's definitely weird because you can tell there's a lot of places that usually have very long lines, that usually are very crowded, and it's, it's not. There's no one here. Are the gardens right by the National Palace Museum and so far this is my favorite part. I actually love this more than the museum inside. It's only 20 NT to enter so in US dollars it's like less than a dollar. Super easy, it's really pretty, it's a nice place to just take a walk, look around and I love it. everyone for coming along with me to the National Palace Museum and the National Palace grounds. I really appreciate it. I hope you liked it. I'm going to go ahead and put some reference links down in the description in case you want to research more about the National Palace Museum or on the gardens to the side. And of course, please subscribe. Please like it. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.
Spirit bird divination. These birds take cards. Hello, bird. So the birds, from what I understand, you tell them who you are, your name, your birthday, and your question. And then there's like a stack of cards, or like a, a box of cards. And then they choose your answers. And then the person like explains the answers, but they like pick the card. It's pretty cool. I've seen it. It's awesome. I wasn't gonna get anything else, but look at all these dumplings. So there's lobster one, there's shrimp, there's all different stuff. And this one is a red bean, little bunny, isn't it cute? I love it. So cute. One of my other goals for my trip to Taiwan was to try this mango shaped ice. It is so fine. It's got such a cool texture to it. There's like a creaminess to it, and the shaved ice is super cool. I've definitely never had anything like this before. How fluffy it is. So cool. This was sort of a bizarre booth where you could like fish for live fish, and you could also um, use like a hook to fish for crawfish. And then if you got however many, you could get a prize if you did it in a certain amount of time. Very strange, I had never seen anything like that. This bar I found in the middle of the night market. This was an American style heavy metal bar. They played a lot of like Avenged Sevenfold, music like that, and it was so random, but also super, super awesome. <laughs> Is there a, a, a cheers? A yeah, like Taiwanese cheers? Kampe. Kampe? Kampe. Thank you. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. This is smoking right here. No blood. Drinking out of it. I can't. I love it. Okay.